water hyacinth an aquatic floating plant belonging to the family pontideraceae and is known by its latin name icornia crassipes is an aquatic invasive and exotic weed in india the plant with beautiful purple flowers were introduced during the british colonial period from tropical and subtropical south america since then the plant has adapted exceptionally well with indian condition and has become a exotic weed growing successfully at an accelerated pace in both hot and cold areas tropical and subtropical zones of the country as well as in lower foothill water bodies this aquatic weed grows so fast that it has the ability to cover the entire surface of the water body within a short period of time unless intervened and completely cuts off sunlight and depletes the quality of water making it toxic and unsuitable for the aquatic life and ecosystem this plant has also been plugging up the waterways making transportation across the freshwater region in india quite challenging but it is quite amazing to note that this trouble plant has been converted into an utility from west to wealth by the individual effort with the monumental role played by an individual called Mr Bikram Mitra from Kolkata Mr Mitra has been a multinational company ex employee who specialized on management and marketing but he left his job due to his passion for environment and worked continuously to come up with this present day solution of utilizing the minans exotic aquatic weed water hyacinth into a treasure mr bikramitro has been instrumental in designing various forms of weaving patterns to be used by using dried stems of water hyacinth various jute fibers and other allied plant fibers into work of art which has commercial value and has been propagating his techniques and methods through numerous workshops conducted in rural bengal and other adjoining indian state in helping rural women to become economically independent by developing these art objects from the raw materials and resources which does not have to be paid in any price for the resources necessary for this artwork but again on production of these artworks which includes baskets bags various uh, other objects that could be used in our daily life made from these plant through unimaginable craftsmanship has been a flagship project that is being well appreciated both in the state of west bengal and other adjoining state mr bikram mitra leads extensive workshops both in various rural districts of the state of west bengal but it also other adjoining parts of eastern india and in south india according to him the southern indian states has invested quite extensively and quite a time back in promoting the use of nature or eco-friendly natural fiber products for manufacture of various utilities that we could use in our daily life both as a daily life use object or home for the home decorative purposes mr mitra has been innovative in coming up with various weaving techniques processing techniques for various kinds of fiber including water hyacinth which he has been teaching to the rural women to help them develop their own sustainable economy and being independent the challenges that he has incurred in his life by going through this process has been monumental 
but it is so much astonishing to note that he has never been deterred by the hardships and the challenges that he came across in developing this techniques and also in disseminating his knowledge to the communities in and around him it was not very smooth but he was a persistent hard worker and through couple decades of extensive work single handedly he has established the methods and techniques for utilization of synthetic manufactured bioorganic paper from uh, water hyacinth stem to using water hyacinth stem and other allied fibers for the purpose of manufacture of both domestic as well as interior decorative purposes mr bikram mitra has been working tirelessly with various environment friendly natural plant products and transforming them into art objects both for commercial purposes as well as for aesthetics his monumental role is being saluted and is being invited with his team in various rural districts of west bengal with request of holding workshops and seminars or colloquium to teach individuals or particularly the rural women both married and unmarried to help them generate income of their own mr bikram mitra said that this business has been going quite good and is catching up with the market as more and more people are finding it very interesting he also uses indigenous leaves of various plants such as palm and uh, sal or terminalia for manufacturing of plates that could be used as a disposable uh, utensils and cutleries for various marriages and other related uh, events where a large number of washing and cleaning is essential this one time throw away biodegradable natural leaf based cutleries that he has developed has been an outstanding effort in protecting the environment mr bikram mitra has been an avid environmentalist and do not leave any effort away in promoting the the need for protecting the health of our environment it has been his monumental role that has shown the spread of water hyacinth stem utilization for the purpose of employment and engagement of rural women as a monumental effort and a project in rural west bengal and in eastern india thanks to mr bikram mitra for his initiative and we pray that he continues in this path helping others to find sustainable way of utilizing our natural resources for creating a better environment shoykat kumar basu kalinga chronicle tv kolkata bureau